Welcome to another midweek moment with Pastor G.M. Thompson, the pastor of New Beginning Christian Faith Center. I am so honored to be with you once again. I'm telling you the Lord is good and he's worthy to be praised. He's worthy to be magnified. He's worthy to be glorified. Great is God's faithfulness. So on today, I'm just going to share a little bit from Lamentations uh, 3 and 23. And the King James lets us know it is of the Lord's mercy that we are not consumed. Praise God. And I just want to do with a hit that we are not consumed. But I like the living Bible. It says it is only the Lord's mercies that have kept us from complete destruction. Great is his faithfulness. Praise God. Glory to God. And that is so wonderful to me. And I love it also. The NLT says, The faithful love of the Lord never ends. His mercies never cease. And that is so great. Because you know what? We got to stand on Him. We got to trust Him. We got to know that nothing is too hard for Him to do. But the Lord's mercies. It's the Lord's mercies. We got up this morning because of the Lord's mercy. Because of His grace. We have been kept all day long because of the Lord's mercies. Because His compassions fail not. His great, he is so faithful to us. Praise God. We're not destroyed because of Him. Glory to God. All the things that are going Going on in the world. He's yet keeping us by his mighty power. He's yet blessing us every day. You know all the things that are going on in the world. Things are going on in Afghanistan, Haiti, all kinds of things. And, and with the virus and the death still going on, God's grace is sufficient. His mercy is everlasting. It is of the Lord's mercies. It is him that's keeping us from destruction. Glory, this, this is why people of God, we need to thank him the more we need to praise him the more. We need to honor him the more. Glory to God. While we have a chance, we need to glorify him and say, oh, give thanks unto the Lord for he is good. Say, God, I praise you. I don't take this time for granted. I don't take rising up for granted. I don't take moving about for granted. I don't take, oh God, feeding myself for granted. I'm clothing in my right mind. I don't take it for granted. It is of the Lord's mercies. Oh God, I, mm, it's the Lord's mercies. And when you think about how good that is, oh, I great that your soul should rejoice. You should be leaping on the inside. You should be so great that the, it's the Lord's mercies. When you look around in your home, when you look around in your family, when you see what's going, going on with you, uh, and glory to God versus in somebody else's house, yes, we pray for others. We want God to deliver them and bless them. Yes, we do. We want people to live and not die. Yes, we do. But praise God, we still got to be so grateful and thankful for his mercies, oh God, towards us and how good he is. Because you know what? It didn't have to be so. That's why we don't glory in ourselves at all. We don't boast in ourselves at all. It is the Lord's mercies. This is why while we have our being, we have a chance to lift him, live holy, walk uprightly. I adjure you, people of God, live holy, walk uprightly. If you aren't saved, ha oh God, change your mind. Give, give, say, God, I need you. I got to have you. And if you are filled with the Holy Ghost, glory to God, God, say, God, I can't take this for granted. Your power, your presence in me, I can't take this for granted. I can't misuse and abuse it. Uh, glory to God. I know it's your mercy. Glory to God. I got, I got to live right. I got to walk up rightly because everything I am, everything I hope to be, I owe it all to you. It is of the Lord's mercies. His compassions. His compassions. That's what does not fail. Glory to God. And we owe it all to him. And we should thank him all the time. So I just want to share that with you. I hope it has been a blessing to you like it has been to me. And I thank you once again for joining us. Praise God for our midweek moment. 
And I'm going to agree with you in prayer. Father, in the name of Jesus, God, I thank you right now. I thank you for your mercies. I thank you for your faithfulness, your compassion, Phil. I thank you, God, with to God. If it had not been for you, I know I wouldn't even be. I could be destroyed. But God, because of your mercies, glory to God, I'm grateful. I don't take your mercies for granted. I'm grateful for your mercies. God, I'm grateful for how you're blessing and touching my brothers and sisters. I thank you for signs, wonders, and miracles happening in our lives. I thank you, God, that you're healing and delivering right now. You open the door, you're making way, you're watching over, you watching over the United States. You're blessing us anyhow. You're blessing other countries. God, in spite of all things, God, you're still worthy to be praised. And I thank you that our faith is in you, God. We don't have doubt today. We don't have fear today. But we know everything is going to be all right, that you will deliver. You will set free. You will help us every day. You know why? Because we know it's your mercies, and we won't take that for granted. We We'll honor you. We'll worship you. We'll praise you. We'll cry out, Lord. I need help. I need to be saved. I need to be delivered. God, I need a refreshing in my spirit. Down in my soul, I need a revival to go on inside of me because I can't let nothing get me down because I know it's the Lord's mercies. It's him that's helping me, keeping me every day. And Father, I thank you for it. I give you glory right now that you're touching somebody. God, they're all oh, God, the understanding is being enlightened right now. They know it's because of the Lord's mercies. Nobody but him, the only true and living God. It is he that is doing it for us right now. And Father, I thank you for it in the name of Jesus. Glory to God. God bless you. God bless you. I am so grateful. I am so grateful for all of you that do listen. Praise God. I don't take it for granted. Amen. Whether it's few or whether it's many. Hallelujah. I'm one of those people. God, if you can bless me to bless one. God, I'm grateful. I have no complaints. And I just want to give God glory. And I give him thanks. So again, join us once again with another midweek moment with Pastor GMT. We love you. Be blessed. See you next time.